Hello, everybody, and welcome to Silent Plays Bloodborne, actually. This isn't going to be any, like, let's play of all the way through the game or anything. I just want to fuck around on Bloodborne, because I just recently got a PS4. I like playing the Soul games to an extent for the co-op, and, um... Figured that this would be a really interesting thing to just fuck around and go and help people out in Chalice Dungeons and such, so... We're gonna go ahead and do that today. I have no idea what the video recording is gonna look like. It's been uh, quite a while since I have done anything. Where I was doing a monitor capture from my rec central to record, like, games on the console. Because I do, like, a really complicated screen capture for full screen and stuff in order to be able to catch this stuff, so... It's a bit of a butt to do, but, yeah. So, okay, so some of the people that know their way around this game pretty well, and the pros and such, I'm gonna do a little stat showcase. Only not really, because, like, I suck at the game, so. I'm gonna be using a level 127 character, which is not too bad. That's all of my shit on the side right there. And, uh, weapons that I have set up is, uh, Ludwig's Holy Blade 10. Blade of Mercy, which is good for speed, and then I have the offhand burial blade for when I want to use something that has range. Cause like this this attack is awesome with the holy blade, but it, it just since it's a thrust, you can only hit what's directly right in front of you if you get it perfectly. Plus it's slow. Sometimes just that extra hit is really fucking awesome with the uh, scythe. They go flying and reeling backwards too. And I'm wearing, of course, the top hat with the uh, yeah, bone ash armor. So right now I'm using basically a skill and blood tinge build with a plus six Evelyn, and yeah, let's go and help some people out now because I've been talking for a bit. But I've been playing this game pretty fucking religiously since I've gotten my uh, PS4, and I've been doing a lot of work on this. So hold on one second as I devour some. Granola bar. Again, I'm not quite sure what the video recording is going to look like because if I move my mouse to check my OBS, you guys are going to see that too. And it's going to be weird because you're going to see a screen capture of my OBS window, which will basically do like the whole portal thing where you're going to see inside of that OBS window 9 million times and it's going to be like a fucking. It's going to be obs -ception. It's really that simple. I thought that my headphones weren't plugged in all the way. Again. This headset works really well, too. For, uh... For the PS4, because I can actually use it to talk through the uh, parties and stuff on PSN, which is fucking awesome. Hey, there's my beckoner. I can already see them right at the start. That's new! I usually have to find them, and they're, like, way further into the dungeon. I'm gonna, I'm gonna salute you. Are we gonna go and kill some shit now? I don't recognize this dungeon that I'm in, though, so I have no idea what we're going to be fighting. Oh, the Abhorrent Beasts. Awesome, I love him. Oh, God. Backing up! Uh! This guy is incredibly quick, and, uh, I don't like that. Let me see if I can get you with a charge up. I could totally get you with a charge up. Can I hit you again? Oh yeah, for the double. Yeah. I'm not gonna do any pro tips or anything, because let me tell you, I get pretty fucked up whenever I do this in co-op, so. This'll be either really good or really bad, and oh, okay. Okay, never mind. We're good. We're good. We're good. Huh? Oi! Okay, that was in the thigh. You didn't like that. Oh, 
Um, what other items do I have here? Oh, that's right, I forget about Madaris' whistle all the time. Oh, that should not have dodged the way that it did. Oh no, you, you stop right now. I shouldn't have been able to get that three-hit combo on him, but it worked. I like it. Come on! What you got, bitch? This is the point where I just get shrecked in the eye. Okay, he's died. He died. I'm gonna make contact with you. Oh god, I got bloodstone chunks out of it. Thank you. Wow, you are the best co-op all day. The first co-op is the best co-op. Well done, sir. Well done, Beckoner, Hades, Haades, or whatever, however you pronounce that. I have no idea how you would go about saying that. I guess he was going for Hades, but it was already taken because Hades is pretty common to use for a screen name. So how many chunks do I have? I need one more Bloodstone chunk? Cool. One more and then I can plus nine this bitch. And then I just need the rock. Dwayne the Rock Johnson to bless it and make it a plus ten because when it's a plus ten it'll be really awesome and cool and stuff. So we're gonna look for another person. And um, I guess we're gonna just do this for 30 minutes or something. I don't know. I don't fucking know. Do I ever think my Let's Plays through? Not really. Okay. That's um, pretty fucking gnarly. Are you... Are you... Oh, you're blood-starved. Okay. I took a quick look at that, and I thought that that was fucking Yarnum Queen. I have never fought Yarnum Queen before. It, she's apparently a possible, like, I, I think you're supposed to fight her in a certain chalice. I don't know which one. All I know is I've never fought her, but this guy looks like the Joker. Oh my fucking lord. Bravo, sir. Bravo. Why so serious? That is the greatest fucking beckoner I have ever had. I fucking love this. Everything about this. Although we are fighting Bloodstar, so I can use the Ludwig's Holy Sword. Okay. I can do that. I don't know if... I think he hates Molotovs. Although, I'm not sure. I'm ready for Blood Starved, are you? Joker's gotta be ready for anything. I don't know what he's doing, but it's weird. Your strategy is very strange, sir. Oh, that's a bad. Okay. That was almost a very bad. Nope. No, 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 no touch. Oh wow, he just fucking teleported. Jesus. Bam! Oh, I missed. Mistakes were made. So this thing is the most ugly and disgusting fucking thing I have seen in the entire game. Period. Considering that, like, flayed skin from its back is, like, flapping in front of his eyes as he's, like, attacking and stuff, and it's just fucking gross, dude. 
This kind of stuff comes out of the head of a madman. It really does. Because what kind of mental state must a person be in to be able to come up with this? This kind of thing didn't exist anywhere else. This is a one-of-a-kind thing. Bloodborne only. Bloodborne exclusive. In the most fucked up mental state that I could possibly ever have, I would never be able to come up with something like this. Okay, here's where the stuff gets really hard now. I never put any antidotes on, though, on my hot slots, which is a mistake. So I guess I'm gonna have to do this without antidotes, because there's no fucking way. There's no way I'm gonna be able to pull out an antidote while in this fight. Oh, that fucking sucks. I can at least hit the bitch. Hey! No! Alright, well, I guess my backhander died. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> That'd be a really useful thing to have equipped for this, actually. Throwing knives or poison throwing knives? Something, I don't fucking care. Flatch... F flapjacked. Okay. And then what I'm gonna put on are, for now, poison knives. If I find out that the poison knives are a bad idea for the boss, well, then I guess I'm just not gonna fucking use them. Oh, okay, thank you. Are you up here? Oh. Hello, friend. And that is how you successfully destroy your enemies from behind. Now, I have zero fucking clue where this beckoner of mine is, so... Because it doesn't look like that they went through the gate to go and fight the boost. Oh, he's down there! Thank you, invisible health bars. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna fall. Fuck that. Hello, friend. Hi. Oh, God, he's using the tanker toy from hell. Dying. I don't like you. Okay. Hi. How you doing? Oh, my God, that was a cooperator. I didn't realize that wasn't the beckoner. The beckoner is up here. Okay. So what do we have to do here, friends? What jolly cooperation do we participate in today? Oh, you just went around? Well, that was stupid. Where are you going? I had never actually done anything. Oh my Christ! She scared the piss out of me. Wow. That was legitimately horrifying right there. I didn't like that. That guy's having a field day downstairs. I can hear him setting up for viscerals. Jesus. Which are essentially like the backstabs of the game and stuff. I should have just walked off like that guy. He's such a he's such a badass. I was thinking prone badass at the same time. Brain think before speak. Oh, there he is! <laughs> oh God, this is this is what I love about this game—the jolly cooperation. Boom! Oh, did I just set her up? I did. Oh, that was a good fucking shot, then. That was a damn fine shot. Hmm. Yeah, these Chalice Dungeons are really fucking large, too, by the way. Anybody who has or has not done that. Basically, this is kind of the end game that I'm doing right now in Bloodborne. See, it's neat, because in the Souls series, like, 
there was the new game plus for your replay value and stuff. But in Bloodborne, you have these chalice dungeons where you can make like chalice rituals or just share a dungeon that somebody has already made. Oh, they're trying to get our attention. Or just share a chalice dungeon that's already been made from somebody else. And then you can use it to uh, just basically generate an infinite number of dungeons that, um, yeah, you just like as many dungeons as you want. You can just keep generating them and generating them or taking them from other people. And it just adds to the replay value. Like, they're all procedurally generated, and it's just pretty cool. I don't know. I don't get this puzzle. There's a lot of ass beating going on upstairs. Ah! Damn it. You first. This is why people don't crowd up on a ladder. You wind up getting stuck in each other's player models. And then what? Well, that guy's dead. Dead as shit. Are there any bell maidens down here? Because if there are bell maidens, they're fucking dead. Goodbye. Oh, that was bullshit. That was bullshit. He just got fucking cheesed. Oh, I feel bad. I, I could have done something, but I was waiting. It took too long for me to wind up. God damn it. Oh, God, that hurt. No. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, go fuck yourself, boy. Yeah! Wow, they ate a lot of damage, actually, though. Holy balls. Well, that sucks. We're down a man for the boss fight now. I mean, there's the NPC, but... Is an NPC really better than a player? You know what? I don't know what this fucking boss fight's going to be. I really don't. Jesus Christ. That guy's pretty fucking terrifying. Watchdog of the Old Lords. I like this fight. Alright. Bring it, bitch! Bam! This guy is, uh... Fire Puppy from Doom. You know. Of death is what I meant to say. Of Doom. Wow. That NPC does take a lot of punishment, though. I'll give him that. I'm really thinking that the Ludwig's Holy Sword would be better in this one. Okay, I need to back up, because he explodes when he gets back up. What? Okay, he's glitching around like crazy. Oh god. Get down, bitch! Okay, backing up. Backing up. And then he's more vulnerable. Ah, fuck you, I was underneath him. All of that buildup all of that time to get one-shotted. Fuck. Oh well. I tell you, this recording has had a lot of downtime of things just not happening. There's going to be so much cutting here, I will be surprised if I have a quarter of the recording footage I have used for it. My god. Like, literally just ass-tons of cutting going to be done here on this bitch. Hey, look, I found my beckoner right off the bat. Hello, friend. You have antlers, and I love it. 
That's a DLC item, actually. A bell-ringing woman rings a sinister bell. This is the sinister Lauren Chalice. Oh. Bad. Bad, bad, bad. So what are we fighting here? Oh, fuck. A Lauren Dark Beast. I fucking hate the Lauren Dark Beast. This is pretty much the only enemy... Oh, God. Pretty much the only enemy that gives me a completely fucking hard time all the time. Because it's impossible to fucking hit, as you're already seeing. Oh, jeez. Well, my beckoner's dead, so I don't have to worry about that one. Can't touch me, though. Da -na 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 -na. Wow. So that first boss run was pretty much the only good run I got the whole entire time on the footage here, so... Oh, boy. I think I'm gonna cut it, though, because I think I have enough to be able to make an episode out of it. I kind of just wanted to fuck around in Bloodborne for a little bit to get a, uh... I don't know, something out there that was Bloodborne-related on my channel. So, we're gonna go ahead and cut it right here, and, uh, highlight of everything today. We, uh, we killed one beast, fought about five of them, ran around aimlessly, died a lot, and, uh, I got hit in the head with a baby. So... That pretty much sums up a Souls game in a general context, really. So, we're going to go ahead and end everything here, guys. So, I will see you later.